welcome to my first ever Decorate With Me series. I am super excited about it. Can you tell? No, I really am excited about it, but uh, I've had quite the morning. I am going to be starting my kitchen edition as far as the Halloween Decorate With Me series. The one you're about to watch is my dining room and I had a lot of fun with it but it was a little bit harder than I thought it was gonna be. Usually, I decorate my house all at once. I don't just do room by room, so that's another reason why it's harder for me. And two, I'm not used to filming. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh my gosh. Got my watermelon juice. Come on. So good, so good for you. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> so for those of you who don't want to watch this um, <laughs> silly intro, you can go to this timestamp. I don't know where I'm going to put it. That's why I do this. And uh, or this timestamp. And you can go straight to the decorating. For those of you who are going to stay, I wanted to say a few things. One, I didn't finish everything. I don't have my drapes up yet because that's a whole freaking rigmarole. I couldn't find chargers, glass chargers at Ross or Dollar Tree. And I don't have salad plates. I wasn't gonna do salad plates, but I messed up on the plates. So I do want a salad plate on there to cover it. There are some voiceovers, but not as many as I thought they were gonna be. Uh, I add, there are a good many parts where I am actually talking to the camera. And then there's a lot of sped up parts where I just do music. And I think that's it. Uh, if you have any questions, just let me know. I did make the, um, I did DIY the plates, the dinner plates. So if you wanna know how I did that, just leave me a comment below and I can put together that video because I did film it. All right, well, let's get right into this. I think that's all I have to say. Oh, no, I have one other thing. Okay, the other thing I needed to say was one, so sorry for my wrinkly see-through pajamas. Mm, Ill-advised. From here on out, I will have uh, regular clothes on, rest assured. The other thing is I wanted to give a huge shout out to Glenna Redcliffe. Yes, I believe her name is Redcliffe and not Radcliffe, but <laughs> I will put it across the screen uh, in case I am wrong. She was nice enough to not only give me a shout out on her last video, uh, which was her Halloween decorating video, but she also put in a snippet of my video and that's just above and beyond, you know? Thank you so much, I greatly appreciate that. What I'm going to do is pin her latest video if I can, in the comments. If I can't, then I will do it in the description. But I believe I can uh, put her channel up um, on the banner. So go and check her out. She just seems like she has just the best aura ever. You know, one of those people. And she has a gorgeous home, a gorgeous home. And what she did with her, her Halloween seasonal decorating was very elegant. Go check her out. Let's get on with the video. Okay. I got some uh, of these lacy things. This one's super old and I actually like this one, but I'm thinking this one might be better on, uh, on my, you know, where my TV is, whatever that, whatever the heck that is called. So I think I'm gonna go with this one. Still not even, I don't know why, because this is the center. Okay, that's better. That's, that is a little bit better. Maybe a little more over there. Okay, so we're done. <laughs> and then this whole room, the dining room, is being decorated off of this couple. So. I know I'm in the way. So yeah, I think. I 
think that's good. And what else? Oh, these trees. These trees. Okay, so that's kind of how she's looking. And then we get a little bit of a close up and see a little better. All right, <clears throat> I tried this look, I'm not liking it. Obviously I wasn't gonna leave the box like this, but um, I think this is too small is what's happening. So I could do something like that, where it doesn't have to be on a pedestal. And then I could go like, take these out, even though I still do feel like I need some other kind of color in here. Uh, you know, we'll get it figured out. We'll get it figured out. I wanted these to be um, with the Headless Horseman theme, and they still might. I already know I'm gonna like that better. But let's take a look. Yes, yes. covering that up you know what I mean so unless I put this on like a pedestal and it was up higher and maybe even this one could be up a little higher then that would work I mean I am it's getting close it's getting close and that adds a little more dimension but all of those frames and the two things that I just added are the same height along with these smaller um candle holder thing, pillar candle, pillar candle. So what I might do is take this small one out and do this big one. So this is basically what I came up with. I took out the, the houses. I'm gonna add lights to that. I'm gonna put in endless candles in those pillars, or I might just do, uh, what do you call it? You know, like the string lights. But, oh, I just need to add um, some more, a few more bats right there. And yeah, I like it. Okay, I've moved on to this little bookshelf. The reason I am speeding this footage up is because it took me forever to figure out how I wanted it to look. You do see actual parts where I'm decorating and it's not sped up, but okay. I thought I would uh, do you a favor. And You're welcome. Okay. I feel like my dog's gonna knock this over. Like either right here I don't know. Like, let's move this up here. So 
we need to do something about that. Okay, so I need to put this on something. Make it like up here a little bit. Still kind of see that. There we go. Oh my God. But that's no. That is not secure. I'm still gonna have to put uh, some putty, some museum putty right there. And then we could do that. And then this can go here, you know? This actually could go up on a stack of books. And then we have ba bow and a ba bow one even though my dog chewed it up because I thought it would look like you know what I mean like uh actually I don't want that one do this um oh you know I just thought it would look uh Like not so everything's put together perfectly. Oh my gosh. ghost. You know what I mean? Let's just see that. I think the top needs some work, but I am not mad at the last two shelves. I'm really not. It's simple, understated. I gotta figure out if I'm gonna do anything different with this top shelf. We'll see. I'm gonna live with it for a little bit. Right. By the way, I uh, did this table the other day. It will be its own video. I did this, uh, I redid this whole, the top part. I didn't do anything to the bottom part other than clean it. Oh, I feel like that's a little too long on this side and not enough on this side. Here we go with the is it exactly even game. Which I personally love to play. Now, I don't eat at this table ever. <laughs> so it's not like I need to be able to pull the chairs in and out. chargers. 
I'll probably DIY them if Dollar Tree has charger plates. If not, I'll probably just get some from Amazon and uh, DIY them. It'll probably be kind of like this. Actually, I might do them black. I don't know. Kind of a close set well not kind of it is a close set of what i did thus far and so now you can kind of see with the creepy cloth like actually it would probably just stick under there on its own because there's velcro underneath there so i'll probably do something like that Anyway, let's keep going, shall we? Let's see, uh, let me back it up. There we go. I did get these uh, little, these little baby skulls from Grocery Outlet, dude. $3.99. Oh my gosh. And the jaw opens on these. $3.99 for this bag of skulls. Can you see this? Let's see here. I think that's pretty cool. In fact, I could do, I could do these on the plates. Oh my gosh. Yes. Let me do another one. <laughs> So I got two black and two brown. God, I wish they had smaller versions of these. They'd go right in there. It'd be perfect. It'd be perfect. These spiders are going to freak me. They're going to freak me out. Oh my gosh. Actually, these are smaller. Oh my God. Okay. Freaking awesome. Pick that out. No, I do not like that because that's over there. This needs to be over here. Excuse me. And then I could put this skull like right here. And that would be like that. I just feel like there's, it's all the same height. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not liking that. a little too cluttered <laughs> and I still feel like I need some some greenery whether I put those potted black drapey plants back in or not I don't really know this is getting a little it's too much it's too much <laughs> I will get a better video at night, but I'm going to do all the chairs like this. And then we have the place setting. This is, this is also going to be a little different. I'm going to do a charger and then I think that's it. I usually do like a salad plate in a bowl, but I think with this, actually I might do a salad plate because see what I messed up. I took the sticker off, but I didn't take the freaking like sticky part of the sticker off. I didn't like I didn't do everything I was supposed to do before I started that. And then here we go with this. Actually, maybe I should turn on this light. There 
There we go. That's a little better. A little better. I, I am liking this, I have to say. today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, and if you don't, kick rocks. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm joking. Uh, so if you enjoyed today's content and you think you would enjoy more of this, I am going to be doing my whole Halloween Decorate With Me series up until October 1st. Anyway, hit the subscribe button is what I'm trying to what I am trying to get at is if you think you'll enjoy more of this content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And you will see all of these decorate with me's my whole house pretty much. That is gonna do it for today. 
I hope you'll have a great rest of your day and I will see you on the next one. Bye.